Hey, so here we are. I um, made a video earlier of coming down to um, get cockles but in the car, but we never actually videoed the cockles, so that's what we're doing today. And we've just pulled up. There's plenty, lots of cockle hunters out here, as you can see. Um, and yeah, let's do it. This is the weekend, this Saturday, so yeah, there's always a lot of people out getting cockles, but we're going to walk right out to the end, where they're the freshest and the best. And then later on, we'll probably make a video of us uh, preparing the cockles and, make, and John are making uh, cockle fritters. It's a bit windy, as you can hear. It's uh, 50 per gatherer. Per day? Per day. Okay, we're slowly getting out there. Um, as you can see, this is the uh, seagrass, and um, and this is what we gather off the beach to put on our uh, gardens. And it seems to have worked really well at keeping the bugs off, and yeah, works pretty well. Okay, the water's starting to get a little deeper. Okay, so here we are. Uh, we've come out of Fairway. See, from the beach way back there, lots of people out here getting cockles. Crazy that there's any left, even, eh? And um, but eh? It's not too bad, though. Yes, it's a brave thing bringing my phone out here. All for your viewing pleasure. Okay, this looks good here. Yeah. Okay, so John is getting down. Which is under and a lot of people go for the uh, clear bits of sand so what you do is you actually go for the sand in the grass and that's where you get the bigger cockles so look at that bunch of cockles already looks like, uh, to me that looks like a hundred cockles. So I'm going to tip them out and do a count. Okay, I just did a count and we have 80. So 
I like to put a bit of water in them. Saturday afternoon. See you soon when we're back at the place and we'll start preparing them. Okay, so we're still walking back, and um, the thing that I find quite amazing is how many people are out here getting cockles, and we're obviously allowed 50 each per day. It's the weekend, so there's a lot more people out here. Um, but this is, this is like they call it Cockle Bay, and, and I, I just, I'm just always trying to figure out. You know, obviously a cockle, it's a shell, and they, they don't exactly grow overnight. And why are there always cockles here, you know? Do they swim in? It's a question I always think to myself, and, and you know, are we actually making room for more cockles by picking them, or...? Yeah. There's something that we always think about. There's always cockles here when we come. Okay, so first thing we do is we get them home, and we give them a rinse under cold water and then we just let them sit for a bit and then they'll spit out a bit of the sand. <laughs> 